Hi, welcome to today's tutorial. Today we'll be learning to make this beautiful apple using um, oil pastels. So the first step is to draw out your apple. Don't worry about your uh, perfection in drawing. Just make sure that you don't use the lines too dark. Otherwise, it will show through your uh, coloring. So I'm going to start with um, an orangish red. So uh, you could basically take out some of these colors. Uh, you can use an orange, a red, a yellow and white and also brown so whenever you're doing any kind of um, coloring you don't have to use the exact same color so if you look at an apple in real it doesn't have one single color throughout it has like a multiple of colors um, a mix of colors and it gives a nice um, shine on one side if there is some light so this is what i'm going to do right now um, i am not going to press the um, the oil pastel too much i am going to use in fact two colors to blend them in together so now right here um, I have uh, lemon yellow so I am adding it on top of the orange um, and you'll notice that all the white areas wherever there are gaps I'm going to add the color over there so it gives a really smoother finish. So there are different kinds of oil pastels which are available in the market. This particular one I'm using is called as um, Tiki and uh, uh, this one requires me to put less pressure so that's the um, fun part about it so my hand is hiding uh, the particular coloring right now but then now you can see it when i lift it um, so uh, now i'm using a slightly darker color the idea is uh, to go layer by layer in terms of your colors uh, you don't have to use um, light to dark or dark, dark to light but it's a good idea to leave little bit of space for your lighter colors um, otherwise some some of these colors don't really give you the freedom um, to give a lot of um, lighter colors on top later so I'm now going to go with a slightly lighter brown. Um, so like I was saying earlier, you just have to build on top of the colors. So each time I use it on a lesser area. So here I'm assuming the light is falling on the right hand side and that's why the dark left hand side is slightly darker. There are many ways in which you can do this. You can also use um, probably a pencil to scrape off certain things. You can use like um, uh, the back of your uh, scale uh, to scrape off some of the things. Um, I don't really uh, use those uh, styles. I like to blend in. I like a smoother finish sometimes. Um, sometimes I go with a darker one or like a slightly textured one. Uh, but in general, um, I like the blending because I think that is very soothing and it's very therapeutic. It feels really nice. Um, so feel free, just keep adding colors one on top of another whenever you feel something has gone too much then you can just scrape it off to use um, uh, use like probably you know scale to scrape it off otherwise it looks really hard uh, to do that so here for the leaf i'm going to be using like green and then some yellow and i'll use some darker green to add in uh, more details i will not be doing an outline for this because i feel like it looks nice even without that um, so i'm just going to leave it as it is the one thing you have to be careful when you're using oil pastels is it's a little sticky so there is a high chance that uh, if you keep your hand on top of your painting it will stick onto your palm and it'll make it a little dirty so what you do to protect it is you can use like a butter paper or a parchment sheet and uh, you can protect also your paintings through that way there is also a spray but that can be used when you're using uh, making bigger paintings so i hope you enjoy this tutorial do subscribe to my channel if you're new here Thank you.